Let's talk about how we can divide a fraction by another fraction. So we have 4 over 7 divided by 3 over 7. What we need to use is the phrase keep change flip. We're going to keep the first fraction the same. We're going to change division to multiplication. And we're going to flip the second fraction. Notice that we could cancel a 7. So we're left with 4 over 3. So that's the answer for the first example. For the second problem, we'll use keep change flip. We'll keep the first fraction the same, change division to multiplication, and flip the second fraction. So now we can multiply across. 4 times 3 is 12. 9 times 2 is 18. Now, 12 over 18, we can reduce that. We could divide both numbers by 6. 12 divided by 6 is 2. 18 divided by 6 is 3. And so that gives us the answer 2 over 3. Now, for the sake of practice, let's try one more example. 4 over 7 divided by 8 over 21. Feel free to pause the video if you want to try this. So let's use keep change flip. We'll keep the first fraction the same, change division to multiplication, and flip the second fraction. Now, we can multiply across, but 4 times 21 is going to give us a big number. Instead, we want to multiply these two fractions using the cancellation method. So let's break down 21 into smaller numbers. That is 7 times 3. And 8, let's break that into 4 and 2. So notice that we could cancel a 4 and we could cancel a 7. And what we have left over is 3 over 2, which is our answer. It saves us time from dealing with 84 and trying to break that down. So that's it. That's how you could divide fractions by other fractions.